Fly! 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 Good. If you need out, just ask Nan. She's got a load of new stock in. If you need out, just ask Nan. She's got a load of new stock in. The fires of freedom sweep the land, set holy ground to flame. And frozen hearts to soften start, released from frost's cruel claim. Oh. How did you know? He just looked at Gil's, uh, Jill's face and could tell that something changed. Yeah. Cut from the cloth. Okay. Bow. There's a very important side quest that needs to be attended to. Oh. The latest adventures of Thirst Master. <laughs> Queen, where you at? Is she just different, or I fear I may have been just me. in giving my heart to Goat. Look past his admittedly handsome visage, and he is little more than an overgrown child at heart. No, it is a man that I need. A real man. In the hideaway is more <sighs> than Blackthorn. When I see him hammering away at a red hot ingot, it's enough to turn my cheeks the same shape. You know what you are, Asta? You are Tumblr.com. You are just fandom, and every week when the newest hot boy on TV shows up. It's time to jump into tags, start your slash fan fiction, and get your pairings going. That is all you are. You can't fucking stick with one thing for more than a goddamn season before someone else shows up and you're all over it. No loyalty whatsoever. You just want to let write your pairings. You want to live in the fantasy world. You have no interest in reality whatsoever. I ain't falling for it. <laughs> Always I know exactly what you are, Asta. Always waiting for the new ship. God. Could be the same on Twitter as well, you know? Always about that new shit. In the most fickle way possible. Is Tumblr still up, or...? I'm sure it's around. Yeah. I think they backed down on the anti-porn shit, so... Oh! You know. So there's a reason to go there. Uh... Okay. I, I wouldn't go that far. Oh. Nonetheless, that's all she is. Uh, Sid, I... I know that when we came to the hideaway, we chose to let go of our past in order that we might focus on our future. We did. Did we? I was wondering if... Well, I know you are from Rosaria, and I'm in need of someone with intimate knowledge of those lands. Apparently, the duchy is home to all manner of curative herbs found nowhere else in the realm. Among them is a flower called a Morgan beard that increases the potency of lesser medicines. I can't say that I've had much practice healing. My youth was spent in the Bailey. A shame. You see, the hideaway relies heavily upon medicines procured from afar. And when those shipments are late, well, it's our sick who suffer. If we could find this flower and learn to grow it here, we might save many lives. However, as you are well aware, Imperial occupation has rendered the roads unsafe for those like me, untrained in the military arts. Now, I'm not asking the busiest man in the hideaway to drop everything and make the journey for me, but if you happen to be in the duchy on other business... I mean, to save lives, then. Absolutely. So this is not about... Soil, is it? <gasps> <laughs> whatever would... Whatever would, would you think would make you think that? I... <sighs> soil? <laughs> Tell me of these Morgans. <laughs> 
wild tomes are to be believed, the flowers are bright yellow and as large as goblin's eyes. Oh, and they grow in the marshes of Sorrowise. If I am to propagate them here in the backyard, I will require several samples, preferably of blooms which have already gone to seed. And before I forget, I do seem to recall learning in the course of my research that their odor has the tendency to attract unsavory creatures. Nothing you cannot handle, though. Uh -huh. sure. All right, Nigel. You're lucky there's a plus. Can't trust these botanists, man. Oh, we've read this. Mm -hmm. And the fruits of her labors. Nope, we're good. Okay. Um, that was the other plus. No. Let me see if uh, that hunting board wasn't worth a shot. Let us know if you find any I wouldn't mind doing a hunt or two, but um, a hunt. Hunter's got a hunt. I saw some saying. Do the S ranks for sure. Okay. Uh, but. Yeah, none yet. I've done what I can, but the rest is up to you. You need to start taking better care of yourself. Understood. And thank you. I was about to say. <laughs> I was about to say. That's awfully casual. Make sure she rests. The curse is spread. If it hurts, you can tell me, you know. I'll understand. I can bear it. But you shouldn't have to. Not anymore. Not alone. It's just your struggle, Clive. It's ours. And when we see how hard you fight, it inspires us to do the same. We've been struggling oh. for years. Would you rather we left you to save the world all on your own? No. That's not... Ignore me. <gasps> Clive! Where are you? Okay. Fine. Fine. That. That's fine. I that is. Feeling. We're in, yeah. though. What's we're wrong? in. I had a feeling someone would interrupt. Super duper in. Under attack. God damn it. What, what else is new? <laughs> like, yeah, and? Is it Thursday? <laughs> this isn't the Dalmechian army we're talking about. It's the men of the rock from Drake's Fang, Hugo Kupka's private guard. There is in hell in Rosalith, trying to batter down the castle gates. Looking for me. Seems that way. Reckon old Hugo has finally worked out who Sid really is. And I'd be hanging out back this is home. Just another trap. Uh, it's a trap, all right. The daddy of all fucking traps. Let me go kick that graveyard around. He'll get real pissed and show up. I'm going to Rosalith. God damn it, Clive. Oh, <laughs> That's exactly what he wants you to do, Clive. Uh, I'm going to piss on this grave. Ah! Such a grudge. <laughs> but as long as it's left to fester, our world will never know peace. 
He has dragged the rest of Storm into this pointless war just to find me. Beside which, I am not about to stand and watch while my home gets ground into the dirt. Oh yeah, he does do a good yeah. landing. Hugo Kuka must die. Never mind that. Lost enough friends to that man already. I don't want to lose any more. So let's go and kill the bastard. Yeah. Jill's like, I want to kill. Yeah. It's great. Never. After all, we're in this together. <laughs> all right. All right. Gav, can you give us a moment? No. No. Nope. No. Okay. What are we doing? Where are we going? We off? We going now? Speak to Otto before leaving. All right. We need to know what we're getting ourselves into. Where? Do, where does apparently he's setting up a giant mile-long wrestling ring? <laughs> <laughs> he's putting the ropes up as we speak. He's standing on the corner of the turnbuckle and he's calling for you. <laughs> Surely you won't answer to such asinine requests, right? <laughs> <laughs> I have to go. Yeah. Yeah. Back to Rosalith then. Whatever has become of her. Man, I sure do hate that character that's just all about the shipping, says Wooly five minutes before he ships Clive and Jill super hard. Super mega hard. <laughs> to be fair, that lean in. That's that is confirmation. That's good. That's, That's good. double tried. confirmation. They tried. All right. That all that means is circumstances got in the way. But if the, if it stayed at distance with a look and there was no like, uh, then you know that not the, the deal not being sealed doesn't matter. There we got and the double the double head lean in is good enough. As they leave the hideout, she's like, I killed a bunch of people. I wasn't in the right place. Oh no! I killed people too. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> we killed. That's what we do! Found the bodies! <laughs> now he's wrecking yours. But he's not going to get away with it this time. <laughs> What's a couple of casualties over a good makeout? <laughs> Come on! Come on, I'm still in the middle. Okay, okay, okay. Still in the okay. No? We don't make out okay. as, as anything more than traveling companions. How about that? <laughs> traveling companions make out! Where are you going? Babe! <laughs> Babe! Babe! <laughs> Babe! Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, shit. All right. Otto. What do you have to say? I mean, from now till the end of time, literally, anyone just... We've got word on the street, Clive. Someone took a dump on Rosalith. I'll be there. <laughs> Gov gave you the news then. We're leaving for Rosalith. But not before I know exactly what's going on. What have we heard? All sorts. Nobody was expecting the Delmax to open up a new front against the Empire, least of all our friends in the provinces. Reports have been rolling in from all over the place, with no two saying the same thing. I've been passing them on to Vivian, and I hope she can make sense of them. If you're set on going, you'll want to talk to her. Understood. He sounds like he's talking with uh, cotton in his cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> Better than rocks. Full on Godfather style. What's new? Ah, a bee, a severian, a belligerent breed of echo that is awakened amid the fallen ruins near Martha's Rest. It will okay. activate on the approach of any human with a burning jet. That looks like it could maybe carry something called Electrum. Not impossible. Secret. Secret. Ooh. While minotaurs have long dwelled in the mountain regions of Rosaria, it's only recently that they have come down from highlands to hunt in the swamps surrounding Martha's Rest. Among their number is one whose sheer size suggests it to be a chieftain who appears to be spearheading the push south. He must be stopped, lest the beastmen develop designs on the rest proper. 
Okay. Um, north of Sorrowwise, Rosaria. All right. Yeah, take a look. See if you can get the exact location of that one. And the uh, Severian. The Severian. And uh, let me take a look at my materials, which I got some cash to spend. West of Marta's Rest Obelisk Fast Travel Point. Okay. Take the lift down into Sorrowwise. Hold that. Hold that thought. Um. So, do I want to move any of these abilities around? No, I don't think I do. Uh, I might take Gouge off, but it's been pretty good so far. I can also, if I do, it would be for something like this. Yeah, that's a bigger thing to, if it's multi-hitting, uh, that would be pretty useful. Let's try, let's try it out. No, no downside. All right, refund. Uh, let's see here. Yeah. And then grab this. Uh, that's gonna be 120. I think I should just have enough, hopefully. Yes, exactly enough. Beautiful. Um, so now you get Flames of Rebirth and Ignition, uh, turned off. So let's put that back on and then Gouge. Let's see. Rook's Gambit is not mastered. Projectile counter. Um... Let me think. Can I keep you over here? Oh, okay. I know what to do. I'll refund Gouge. Yes. Uh. Yes, refund Gouge. No, wait. Wrong. Wrong ability. What am I doing? Um. 15.75 in the pocket. And then we're going to dump that. Oh, no, we don't have enough to go into this. Ah, uh, I see. Hmm. That is costly. It is, it is, it is. I, so I wanted to put it here is the issue. Um, but that's not going to work. I see. Uh, I could temporarily refund something else. Like, uh, can I go back to unlocking of the? No, I can't necessarily. I'm, I'm, yeah, locked in there. Keeping that. Okay. All right. Sorry. 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 All good. Uh, yeah, I, I unfortunately don't want to change this setup too much. Um, so, let's do this. Ah, fuck it, whatever, let's just try this then. Put this over here. And then put Heatwave over here. And just for my brain, swap these two. You can duplicate, weirdly. All right, lightning rod is there. Projectile counter. Okay. Yeah, probably not going to keep that, but we'll just f try it a little bit for now. <coughs> Excuse me. Um. So with that money. Oh, 
Wait, couldn't I? <sighs> Sorry, I just confused myself. Yeah, let's just put it back in then. Yeah, no. We'll just do this. Put it back in, and then change the order around, and then we'll fuck around with it like this instead. See how that works. Okay. Alrighty. What is the uh, location again? Uh, west of Martha's Rest. Somewhere along Sorrowwise Elevator. Yes, west of Martha's Rest Obelisk, fast travel point. Take the lift down into Sorrow Rise. Martha's Rest. Okay. Thank you for sticking with us. And I'm back to being alone. What are you after? Even you've got platinum swords now. Everybody level up. There you go. The economy is flowing. That all, is it? Yes, yes it is. We're still here. Have to look after each other, don't we? So perhaps I'd live longer if I'd bad this town farewell. I've grown rather fond of the old place. Take ages to Hmm. Seems like you're not too far from that Morgan beard thing. From what? The Morgan beard, the root of the problem? Ah, yes. That's there too. Mm -hmm. Ribbit. I wasn't sure if it was a rock or not. Now that's a Bayo 3. That's a Bayo. <laughs> that is a hard Bayo. That's a Bayo 3. Big Bayo. Yeah. Get that toothpaste. Out of range. That was weird. Denied. Whoa, visibility. What is going on? What is happening? What is he doing? Oh, this is not great. That's right. not great. Embrace. What a stinger. Not oh, that one. Weird. Oh, 
Uh oh. Eradicate. Nice. Fuck yourself up. Okay. Uh, this button layout's fucking me up. Oh yeah, the with the new aggressively stuff. so. I don't know what's going on. I thought it would do more hits. Okay. It's still weird to look at. Very much so. Gotcha with this thing here. Another one! Took your health. He took two health bars from you. In your face. Alright, get that will to 50. Uh oh. Ah, not that ability. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. And... Okay. okay. No, completely, completely fucked. <laughs> I hate it. I hate it so much. That was... The new not thing. great. Hey, there's your Electrum. What a call! That was sick. Nice! Okay. Just on the, uh, it's just on the design of the monster. <laughs> mm -mm. You are the, um, uh, it one fuck it, you can't see the fight, man! I, the damage was not as, much. Uh, it wasn't doing, uh, it wasn't hitting as much as I expected it to, you know? And this seems like a group of people would probably, you yeah. know, get taken care of, but I'll just do the fucking Flames of Rebirth instead. Um, and on top of that, the, the, the order changed around and kind of uh oh didn't want it so uh you come off um and you go back to being where you were and then um <sighs> what does this one look like yeah yeah, that's that's a maybe. That's a maybe. Um, might be cool. For now, we'll just gouge back up. And put the rod here. Yeah, this feels like uh, a nice one big hit. Um, but what I want is a I, I'm looking like I'm hoping for a gouge replacement for utility. Like I'm looking for a combo filler, you know, for um, for stagger to build up the hits. Uh, that'd be that'd be fun. Anyways, um, took care of that. She's near the Abbey is certainly damp. Let's see if they're damp enough for Morgan Beards. Nice. And you got some goblins to compare uh -huh. the Morgan Beards with their eyeballs. Yeah. Increases bolts. Uh for use on staggered. Yeah, okay. Uh, does it say that for this as well? Because it's... No. Okay. Because, yeah, I guess this is, is this more of a... Com this looks like a combo ender. 
since it's uh, like a big hit, but the multiple bolts are hitting the different things around. Mm, collateral judgment. Yeah. Okay. Man, these these goblins are high level. Okay. Rude. Well done. I mean. Bird. While we're at it. Oh, it is dying fast. You know. Mm, oh. Yeah. Look at that. Great, great points. Solid. Good farming. Aha. Uh -huh. Biggest plus Wayne. Plow Wayne. Oh shit. The team's here. Watch yourself. Big swing. That was like seven swings. Three patches. Bright yellow. These are our Morgan beards, all right. Well, I've gone to this much trouble. Might as well go. There's something familiar about this scent. It reminds me of home. Oh. Well, yeah. I mean, the goblin eyes are pretty big. Enough. I've had my fill of goblins. <laughs> All right, we are we are in fact standing in Rosaria. But it should remind you of home, <laughs> hopefully. Uh, yo, Blackthorn. Yes. Quit fapping with the leather for a second. <laughs> Make me some cool shit. Hello. Back here, yeah. Just like dressed head to toe like a fucking dom. <laughs> Just studded out. <laughs> Sorry, <what are> you? <sighs> 
with the headgear and everything. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I found my calling, Clive. <laughs> Thank you once again. Um, yes, sir. That's the one. And Scarlet. Yeah. Okay. It'll last you a good while. Done and done. Thank you. Fine. Now we uh, got one new of everything. And while we're at it, here's your stupid flowers. <laughs> what door was this again? Oh, shit. <laughs> Never mind. Yeah, that's right. Pretending like you know, you know about this door. Stay out. Yeah, there was another uh, back of the vineyard. There's another room where the lady just standing there going like, If you want to know what's behind this door, you'll never find out. <laughs> okay. Like, uh, alright. Not while I'm on guard or whatever. Like, mm, someone made it. It is rare that we see you so often in the backyard, Sid. What brings you to the gardens? Here's your four. bloody flowers. Yeah, some Morgan bear. Soil intact. I found your flowers. Yes, yes, wonderful. These are almost identical to the plates in my tongue. Did you have any trouble locating them? Finding them was the easy part, but it's odd. They remind me of my childhood somehow. I don't remember these flowers specifically, but you must have grown them in the castle garden. If the petals are meant to improve the effectiveness of medicines, it's possible that the core physicus grew them for the tinctures and treatments they made my brother. If the ducal healers were convinced of their properties, that is all the more reason to begin growing our own supply here. Oh, allow me to use some of the flowers you brought me to make something that might aid you on your travels. I need only a moment to extract the essence from the petals. Hit the grow up. Ah, oh, wasn't there a garden when we were young Clive at the very beginning? Mm-hmm. I forget how it looked like, though. I wonder if they, they were, were tending flowers. that bud. Yeah. <laughs> with the... with and their magic. A file of pure Morgan Beard extract. A file? A single drop added to any one of your restoratives will increase its potency. At least I hope it will. Ah. Quest complete. The balance between THC and uh, CBD. <laughs> Believe it or not, it's direct. It's one to one. Morgan Beard extract. Uh huh. That's what Nigel of the backyard says. That's cool. Does that? It doesn't mean number go up. It just means it it heals more. Yeah. Increasing the potency of most consumables. Most potions and high potions down restore more. Okay, from now on, permanently. Great, 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 great. That's sweet. I was hoping it wasn't a, like, temporary thing. It's yeah. like, oh, for the next ten minutes you can heal more. It's like, I don't want the, what the fuck would that point of that be. Alright. I'd like to hold more rather than heal more, but, you know. I suppose that's fine. Esther sips and Esten's potency. I just feel like every time we auto use one, it feels like I'm getting robbed a little bit. Okay, so it feels like uh, there's a lot of like. There's a lot of talking and post-mission cleanup, and then the next time you set off, it's like a pretty obvious, like, go to that location. Mm -hmm. So I feel confident doing all these little, like, talking things until the game says, all right, go select that place to go to it. True. Which is rather uh, straightforward and appreciated. Hello, Vivian. If it isn't my favorite pupil. Am I your only pupil? Let's see now. Where did we leave? 
Well, this is a surprise. Huh. My lectures are rarely so well attended. Uh, you know what they say? A little knowledge uh, can't hurt? Yeah, that's what they say, all right. We're going to Rosalith to deal with Kuka. What's the situation there? Whoa there, Lord Rossfield. I'm sure you're champing at the bit to return to your roost. But to fully understand the present situation, one must first understand how it came to be. All right, show me that map. I want her to be holding one of those like little sticks when <laughs> pushing the pieces. Or the permanent economic advisor to the Dalmechian government to give him his formal title. Naturally. In a republic founded on commerce, there could hardly be a more influential position. It has granted him both mm. extraordinary wealth and extraordinary power. Not that he ever wanted for the latter. Being Titan's dominant, he is also Dalmechia's last line of defense. Man, that's badass. Mm -hmm. advantage. Give me that parry, baby. Drake's fang, one of the pillars of the Republic from Parliament's grip. And he was quick to buy the loyalty of the Fang's protectors. Today they are his faithful creatures, a private army in all but name. The self-same army that marches upon Rosarian soil as we speak. Ah. Oh. By which I mean imperial soil, not that you need reminding of the fact. Suffice it to say, the Empire's attentions are elsewhere at present. Deadlocked as it is with Dalmechia over its occupation of the Crystalline Dominion. Ta that's true, technically. Are now gathered. He's calling for us out, but... Garrisons remain to secure its western provinces, and half of them left after the fall of Drake's breath. It is Empire. With the threat of the Ironblood thus diminished, they had little cause to fear a maritime invasion. And so today, only a token force guards the former duchy's shores, as Kupka was quick to descry. He landed his troops on the Rosarian coast without encountering so much as a single ship. All for you, Clive. He wants your head. And so he and his men advance upon Rosalith, not to capture the province. But to draw you out. But that can't be. Come on, Clive, keep up. You said Kupka's forces sailed up the coast. What of Port is older then? Is the city safe? Quite, according to the Guardians of the Flame. The Dalmechian fleet floated by without incident. But not without remark. When they learned Kupka's forces were making for Rosalith. Our friends were quick to begin arranging the exodus of her citizens. And so the stage will soon be set for your heroic homecoming. Alas, it will be a more trying task to enter the capital than it was to leave it. Hugo's men hold Buett Bridge, despite the Imperials' repeated attempts to wrest it back from their grasp. And they were careful not to repeat the Empire's mistake in neglecting their coastal defenses. The seas around Rosalith are firmly under Dalmechian control. So tell me, pupil mine, what do you believe to be the best route to Rosalith? Don't say the front door. The north. Okay. The same one we've been using? We cross the northern border near Phoenix Gate, then take the road through Stillwind down to the capital. Hardly the quickest route, but at least we won't be spotted. A little local knowledge goes a long way. And so must you. We'd best get a move on then. Oh, will you be going too? I? I've been waiting a long time to give that fucker a taste of his own medicine. <laughs> I would have missed this for the world. Oh, Gav's time All for right. revenge. We should be on our way. Lead it's on. Gav time. <laughs> no time like Gav time. Woo. Yeah, there we go. Clive, it appears that the men have taken the city, but they're not really destroying anything or burning anything down. They're making straight for the giant crater and are attempting to turn it into a humongous goatsy. Any idea why they'd want to do that? <laughs> it appears they want to draw me out. <laughs> oh. 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 I guess. 
Do we have to go? <laughs> we have to go immediately. How dare they? <laughs> oh, my. Not while I live and breathe. <laughs>